what's up and welcome but this time it's not to my channel if you are watching this video that means you purchased the you bought this video because you have the problem of dark spots or and scars or just dark spots on your skin so i'm going to be showing you how to make a body scrub and a body wash that will help you over time to get rid of the of the dark spots scars and it's just generally going to polish your skin overall and make it glowy brighter more even toned complexion instead of seeing maybe your forehead is darker than your face all those stuffs so it's going to help your skin a lot and you're going to come back and thank me for it so without further blabbing let's see how we're going to make this stuff so we are going to be starting with our aloe vera plant aloe vera is a very good plant used for uh, skin healing and just skin healing generally so i just kept that she pop this in but it's optional so i'm just using my spoon to scrape out the gel of the aloe vera okay. so next after squeezing the aloe vera in the plates as much as you want we are going to be using um sugar the normal sugar you use for your tea I'm using about five spoons of sugar to fill into this container and don't worry because of the yellow stains you see there is a little bit of turmeric oil that stained it or turmeric that stained it so next I'm using turmeric turmeric so we are going to be using one full spoon of turmeric powder which goes for five spoons of sugar and I'm going to mix in, we'll be mixing it properly and I added a half more because I felt the turmeric wasn't popping enough so I'm adding coffee black coffee black coffee is very great in smoothing out the skin removing cellulite fat and is a great antioxidant for the skin so I'm adding it up then I'm adding honey and I'm using two spoonfuls of honey i used two spoonfuls but it didn't i didn't show it in this video next i'm using jamaican black castor oil i'm using about um two spoonfuls of jamaican black castor oil and i'm just adding it into the mixture so i'm going with coconut oil too and i'm using two spoonfuls i think yeah i use two spoonfuls and i start to mix it up until it forms this consistency you will see if your own is still having a residue of sugars that were not properly mixed you can keep adding in your oils until it's, it's it has this rough well mixed consistency you are seen on the screen i don't know how to describe it but i hope you can see it and that's it for making the scrub this scrub is full of a lot of benefits. Now for the body wash. We are going to be using black African soap as the first ingredient. And you want to make sure the soap you are buying can be easily broken by your fingers. That's how to know an original black African soap. Um, I'm going to get a grater. That's a grater there. And I'm going to use it to shave the soaps into smaller um, sizes. So I could easily melt it. Next, I'm going with apple cider vinegar and I'm going to be adding 50, that's a 5 ml spoon, I'm going to be adding 15 ml, that's 3 of that spoon. Then I'm going with my turmeric powder and I'm adding 1 spoonful, this is a teaspoon of the turmeric in, into it. Then this is the magic, magic product and it's potash, potassium alum potash I'm going to be adding that size you want to add a little bit you don't want much because if you add much just add a little bit to you know what your skin tone is then I'm adding hot water to the level of everything and I'm going to cover it up so that the everything can melt into the 
and become liquid. So this after I've left it for long and it has finished melting, I'm going to get a container and I'm going to pour in my soap. So after seeing how to make it, I'm going to be showing you how we are going. I use it on myself. So the first thing is the scrub. You are going to pick the scrub up and you are going to use the scrub like three times in a week. So when you step into the shower to have your bath, when you've poured the water on your body, you just soak your, wet yourself up with water and you are going to take the scrub in, the, the, in your fingers and you are going to use circular motions to buff out your skin. Do not use the scrub on your face, but from your neck downwards, it's a body scrub. It's too harsh, I would say, for your face. So it's from your neck, it's for your neck downwards. So you are just going to use circular motion to buff away dead skin cells. And like those dark spots are caused by the accumulation of um, dead skin cells, excess melanin, and scar tissues. So it's going to scrub them off gradually till it scrubs everything off. Why the body wash? You are going to anytime you are batting, whether in the morning or in the night, that is going to be your batting soap. It lathers very well. You are going to wet your sponge and put a little bit and just soap it. Just the way you use your soap to bat, pretty much it. That's what you do. But you scrub your body before batting. It's after scrubbing, then you just have your bath to wash everything off all together so that's pretty much how you use it in two weeks you should see a difference i can't wait to hear from you Make make sure you share with me your 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 results because i want to hear from you so that's it for this video One I love to hear from you so that's it for this video that's everything if you have any questions 